Phil Parkinson's got the top job up there uh, at uh, the Stadium of Light at Sunderland, beating the likes of Gareth Ainsworth to the role. His CV, he's had promotions with Bolton and Colchester out of Skybet League One. But the Sunderland fan base are divided on this appointment of Phil Parkinson. A good number, not too happy. Sean Derry, I can't understand why. No, I'm with you, Dan. I really can't. Um... <laughs> What are they expecting? Who are they expecting? I know Jose Mourinho is out of work. He wasn't <laughs> going to go and pull on the shirt for for Sunderland, was he? I think it's. I think you're right. I, I think it's showbiz, Sean. That's yeah, the worry. I do. I think, yeah. You know, I think you can get carried away with the um, with the history of the football club. This is League One. Sunderland are League One. Yeah. And they played like a League One team last year because they didn't get out of it. And do you know what? They've done the same this year as well. So let's rally round Phil Parkinson. He's got a pedigree. He understands the levels. He gets teams promoted out of this division. He's only about 800 games with two clubs. This man knows how to get stuck what in. What I'll say, Mark, is if you think you deserve better than Phil Parkinson, you think you deserve a better style of football because you are Sunderland Football Club, you need to get real. You yeah. need to look in the mirror. You need to realise what is needed to get out of League One. And Phil Parkinson on his CV with a couple of clubs has demonstrated exactly that. I can't understand why there would be doubts around that appointment uninspiring us all one Sunderland fan and name then, his appointment, which is just mind-boggling. It is that kind of, and, and, you know, you don't really facile about it, but unfortunately sometimes, well, that's what we are as fans. I think they thought they wanted something sexier. Or they want some showbiz out there. Phil Parkinson, God bless him, looks like and sounds like a fella who'd basically been in football for possibly 300 years. It's kind of just this kind of dyed-in-the-wall football man. OK, so what he isn't is, as I say, a sexy particular signing particularly. But you're not telling me that with the resources he's had and the runs that he's had in cups and the way that he's saved his teams over the years from relegation... I mean... Remember, he chose to go to Bolton anyway. There was, you know, he didn't even get to. He didn't leave a club. He's never, he's never really been sacked in earnest by a big, a big side. And I, I defy anyone to tell me how Phil Parkinson has ever played one way shot. Do you know why you manage your manager? Look at where their teams are now after they've left. Yeah. And that's with Phil. You know, Phil now is like I've said. He, it is what it is on a tin. He'll deliver for Sunderland. I've got no doubt in my mind that in the next two years, they'll be back in the championship. Whether they get back playing the most romantic style of play or whether it's the most boring style of play, boring style of play, Sunderland will be back in the championship within 24 months. It's guaranteed.